Religion is one of the hottest buttons anyone can push. And if you believe in a benevolent deity, then you fit into the most acceptable group out there. But even if you hint at believing in something sinister, then the attention is all on you. Here are 10 famous people who worship the devil, maybe. Feeling feisty? Hit that subscribe button and be the first to know every time we release a video. Marilyn Manson this isn't necessarily a huge surprise since Marilyn Manson is known for being heavily involved in Anton LaVey's Church of Satan. Despite the name, the Church of Satan actually doesn't worship the devil and instead consider themselves to be atheists. Manson is a card-carrying member of the Church of Satan and is even an honorary priest. Based on his music, image, and the messages he displays, it's not shocking that many people think that he is worshiping the devil. Ozzy Osbourne Based on Ozzy Osbourne's career, it would be hard to believe that he didn't engage in devil worship. Between getting called Prince of Darkness, being a part of the band Black Sabbath, biting the head off a bat, and playing up the image of evil and darkness, poor Ozzy has found himself at the center of a lot of theories. Many of these theories also stem from the numerous references to Satan and Lucifer in Black Sabbath's music, as well as the band's signature look. Lady Gaga to religious enthusiasts, Lady Gaga can easily come across as someone who worships the devil, considering that she embraces and promotes the opposite of what numerous churches teach. However, after she said, I swear to Lucifer on Jimmy Kimmel, rumors went rampant, accusing the singer of worshiping the devil. Granted, the comment was said sarcastically, but the public is left to wonder and assume the worst. She was also accused of participating in a satanic ritual after after she left a bathtub full of blood at London's Intercontinental Hotel. Robert Johnson Born in 1911, Robert Johnson is probably one of the most well-known musicians who is tied to the devil. He claimed that he went to the crossroads and made a deal with Satan himself to become the best blues guitarist in the world. People who saw Johnson play before the deal and after the deal said there was a dramatic difference in the way he played. Johnson died at the age of 27 from mysterious circumstances, which furthers the theory that a deal was made and that his contract was fulfilled. Rihanna Rihanna was signed on to Def Jam Records by Jay-Z at the age of 16, and she has been dubbed the Princess of the Illuminati. Considering her dark image and because the lyrics to her song Disturbia describe demonic possession, people have assumed that Rihanna worships the devil. After the release of her song Russian Roulette and the fact that it was glamorizing suicide, Rihanna got numerous accusations of working for Satan and trying to influence young people to take their lives as sacrifices to the devil. Jane Mansfield Jane Mansfield is one of the most famous alleged members of the Church of Satan, who met Anton LaVey a few times and even participated in a photo shoot with the Satanist leader. Rumor has it that Jane originally wanted to be Catholic but was rejected by the Vatican for her previous marriages, so she made a deal with the devil to become famous. Her boyfriend, Sam Brody, allegedly insulted LaVey and a hex was placed on him that would guarantee that he'd be dead within a year, and rumor has it that Jane was also a victim of the hex. Nicki Minaj Nicki Minaj is often nicknamed Satan and has become famous for pushing the envelope in her songs and performances. There is satanic imagery in her look and she even has an alter ego named Roman Zelansky, which is an homage to the infamous movie producer Roman Polanski, the husband of murdered actress Sharon Tate. Minaj said that Roman was a violent male alter ego that was conjured up and will not go away. During her 2012 Grammys performance, Nikki had a mock exorcism which featured sex slaves and was accused of performing a satanic ritual. King Diamond 
King Diamond is a heavy metal musician who is a member of the Church of Satan. He doesn't necessarily see it as a religion, but more as a philosophy of living by Anton LaVey. However, on stage and in performance, King Diamond takes on a satanic look that can make any naive audience member believe that he engages in devil worship. In 1988, the musician was made an eternal member of the church by LaVey himself. Liberace Liberace was no doubt probably one of the flashiest members of the Church of Satan. The musician was one of the first members of the church and even credits his involvement in the organization for his success in the industry. Liberace and Anton LaVey were also good friends. Kenneth Anger Filmmaker Kenneth Anger has a weird fascination with Satan as he has a Lucifer tattoo across his chest. Today, he is a practitioner of paganism, not necessarily devil worship. Anger was also friends with LaVey before he started the Church of Satan. He also studied Aleister Crowley, who was well known as an authority on the occult. Not to mention, Anger has also made a short film called Lucifer Rising. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and don't forget to subscribe to The Richest for more incredible, fascinating videos daily. Thank you for watching.